Next thing we're gonna do now is adjust your backpack once you get it. So I have my freeloader here and I have all the straps nice and loose. You wanna make sure they're very loose before you put them on. You have your hip belt, shoulder strap, lip loader, which is right above the shoulder strap, and your sternum strap. So I'll put it on. Now before adjusting, it's good to have a little bit of weight in your pack. So we suggest putting a book, maybe five or 10 pounds in your pack before doing the adjusting. You're gonna start at the bottom, bottom to top always. Get a good foundation. You're gonna click in your hip belt, grab the two straps on either side and pull directly in front of you. Get it nice and cinched up because the majority of the weight is going to be on your hips. About 80% of the weight will be carried by your legs and your hips. Then you're gonna move up to the shoulders, grab them with your hands, put your elbows by your side, and just pull down and back. Good, nice and cinched up there, good and tight. Make sure when adjusting the shoulders, you want a good fit. You don't want a big gap between your shoulder and the actual pack. Next are the lift loaders, which are on top of the shoulder straps. And you'll grab those and pull towards you. This helps distribute the weight forward. Lastly is your sternum strap. Click it in and just get it nice and taut, not tight, but just a little tension to get the pressure off your shoulders. Now, like Paul said, always remember to go from the bottom up when adjusting your pack. Now, it's also important to know that if you're new to hiking or carrying large loads, you're gonna wanna start slow. Say 15, 20 minutes the first day on a light hike with your child in it, and then work your way up 10 minutes or so each day. That way you can build up new muscle memory and strength and endurance when carrying your child. And you're good to go. Happy freeloading. Bye guys.